And police are looking for three people accused of burglarizing cars as their owners were just a few feet away. Eight on your side's Marco Villarreal joins us live in Hillsborough County, and he has new information on this case. Marco, these were some bold thieves. Very bold. The detectives are calling this a crime of opportunity, which may explain why those panicked suspects, after they jumped over this gate, left a trail of evidence that is building a stronger case against them. To be clear, it's still a crime. Amanda Campbell and her husband Nick have quite the tale to tell after running after the car burglars they saw rummaging through their stuff while on private property. There was quite a pile of stuff that they took. Yeah. Um, there was a lot of a lot of financial stuff that, that they sat in our car and and very carefully went through. Nick took photos of the three men and one woman jumping the fence to get away, then joined the chase. I chose the older gentleman who I figured I could probably <laughs> keep up with. 52-year-old <laughs> Gabriel Ahumada Marino charged with burglary. Deputies say he comes up as homeless with no prior criminal history in Hillsborough County. A day later, the Campbells make another shocking discovery. And they buried all of our stuff in the goat feed. Investigators think the suspects dropped the stolen goods as they ran off. And I think they thought they'd just sneak in, quietly steal a bunch of our belongings and leave. And it turned into chaos and Not madness. Their friend got arrested. And again, here's that gate where they snuck in and couldn't get back out. Police are still looking for those three suspects. If you know anything about this case, please contact the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office. For now, reporting live in Hillsborough County, Marco Villarreal, 8 on your side.